if you have an opinion on Tesla's approach to using a camera only system and eliminating radars from its vehicles. For each company and each vehicle line, there's a particular goal. For some companies, the cost is very important. The efficiency of those materials are very important. For other companies like us, safety is key. We don't want to miss that even 1% of the edge case mm -hmm. where you, you're in a less visible weather conditions. You still wanted to understand what's going on around the vehicle. It's more important to cover that. 100% as close as possible. And of course, we're positioned as a more luxurious vehicle. And then our customers would like to get that value out of the LiDAR. On the topic of autonomous driving, one thing about Tesla's system that is so differentiated is that every vehicle on the road equipped with autopilot hardware, whether autopilot is in use or not, is collecting training data that is used to inform its model to continuously improve on its autonomous driving capability. What's Faraday's approach to the data collection and labeling component of self-driving? Privacy first, particularly for our vehicle proposition. So we're targeting the high end of the vehicles. That's sort of our first principles is to, to figure out, hey, how, how do we get the right privacy first? Mm -hmm. And then figure out how do we optimize the vehicle performance? And does that involve data aggregation from vehicles on the road or does it take a different approach? Only when the customer allow us to collect certain data, we would do it. If they're not comfortable, that's something that we don't, we don't do. Got it. Yeah. Awesome.